Alrighty, what's up everybody? Peter Gilmore here for my second video of the day. Right here on Peter Gilmore, the Peter Gilmore YouTube Wrestling Channel, YouTube.com slash Peter Gilmore. Thank you all for watching. Make sure you like the video and hit that subscribe button down below and hit that bell. God damn it. Alright, on this Friday afternoon, gonna be, uh, I have to go out in a couple minutes to do some errands. But I want to get this video up real quick. By the way, check out my, uh, my my video on Hank Aaron, he passed away today, so check it out on the Metal God Six Six Nine channel. So just go to the check, go to go to the, just type it in the search bar. You know where it is. Uh, that's all I can say about that. But quickly, I want to talk about as the title below says, I'm going to talk about some WrestleMania Thirty Seven news, and this came out a couple of days ago. Now WrestleMania Thirty Seven is going to be a two-night event, once again, like WrestleMania 36 was, but this time it's going to be at Raymond J Stadium in Tampa, uh, which was supposed to be last year with, due to this fucking virus. You know, couldn't do that because it was at the Performance Center. But this, this year is going to be at Raymond J Stadium in Tampa, April 10th and 11th. So, WWE's version of Wrestle Kingdom. Where did they get the two-day idea? Hmm... Just saying. So, it's been reported a couple days ago that WrestleMania 37 was going to be a two-day event. But this time, it's going to have fans, ladies and gentlemen. Real-life fans, ladies and gentlemen. 15,000 fans, to be exact. Now, is, is that going to happen? I don't know. You know, they've had fans in Tampa for the football games, for the Buccaneers. Um, you know, I think they had, the, I think the last game was, the last, uh, no, it wasn't. The thing the Buccaneers were on the road against the Saints, and they beat the Saints. Uh, you know, big ups to Drew Brees, great career, great career, and Phillip Rivers, great career. But you guys sucked in X6 to Brady. That is what it is. But Brady is the GOAT. It is what it is. But, you know, during the season, they had fans, not many fans, but... I don't know if they're going to get 15,000 people in Raymond J. Stadium... On April the 10th and 11th. I really don't think they are. But we'll see. And uh, that's all, really all I got to say about that. Um, if they do. If they get 15,000. Great. But. Not, there's nobody gonna, there's nobody going to be sitting ringside. Let's be honest. I don't think anybody's going to be sitting ringside. It's, uh, I think they're going to have the LED screens. For the f other fans. You know, like I have at the Thunder Dome. So that's probably going to be. You know, around the ring, and then you know they're gonna be seated on seated on like different sides of the stage. It's the stadium, I should say. So I'm not gonna be fans of ringside. I highly doubt it. But you never know. But if they pull it off, great. But we'll see. I mean, if you know this virus starts to starts to dwindle down, hopefully by April, April or May, we can get maybe fifteen thousand people at WrestleMania. Then you can start thinking about maybe SummerSlam, maybe extending that to maybe 20,000, 25,000. You know, it's a stretch, but I don't know. We'll see. Hopefully by the fall, we'll get 25 to 50% capacity at, at arenas, uh, the WWE and AEW and Ring of Honor. And maybe CCW can get back on the road with fans at the arenas doing live events. Not house shows, live events. You know, because I think house shows are going to be completely done with. You know, indie shows can get back up and running, you know, in the New York, New Jersey area or wherever you may be. Hopefully they can get back up and running and get some fans, like 150 fans at most, you know, depending on what indie fed you're in. Uh, so we'll see. But 15,000, I think, is a stretch for WWE. I think Vince really want. I know Vince wants fans at WrestleMania. I couldn't get them last year. Except for that fan in the Performance Center. But, if I, like I said, 15,000 fans, I think is a stretch. I would go with maybe 5,000 at most. 5,000. Maybe 10,000 at most. 15, I think, is a stretch. But if they can get 15,000 in Raymond J Stadium, socially distanced, wearing your fucking mask, and cleaning your fucking hands, but... I hope I hope they do. I I really hope they do, and and WrestleMania is a success. But uh, we'll see what happens with that. With that. 
So that's all I really got to say. Leave me your thoughts and comments down below. What do you guys think about fans at WrestleMania 37 this year? And that's all I got to say for that. All right, everybody. I got to get going. I got to do some errands, and I'll be back later. And uh, that's all I got to say about that. So thank you all for watching. I'm Peter Gilmore signing off. Peace, bitches.